today's five minutes with this is Dan Godwin, and he played after I did at Room Five Lounge in Los Angeles. And you're here visiting from New York. From New York City, yeah. Yeah, and um, I thought you guys said it was really beautiful. Like, you as well. Oh, you as well. Thank you. <laughs> this is about you, Joe. You threw me out there. Um, so your three feet. Do you remember to say those two guys? Uh, when I'm out here, yeah, this, those are my oh, they, go-to guys. They yeah. live here. They live here. Yeah, yeah. they're my LA band. You know, okay. LA. Okay. Food. And um, I thought that I mean you played so beautifully. It was it was tight but still open. Yeah. You know, it's yeah. really poetic sounding and yeah, it was, uh, it was really beautiful. It had a lot of nice flow while still being tight. They play really well with you. Thank you. Thank yeah. You. And your songwriting and his voice. Oh yeah. So um. When you booked the show three weeks ago, yeah. And are you on tour or are you just landing here? Yeah, I'm on tour. Um, not with these guys, but I'm, I'm kind of doing a solo thing. I'm doing with uh, Tyler Hilton and Ryan Cabrera. Oh, cool. And some shows with Howie Gay. It really just depends. Oh, on right. Yeah. That's great. I'm kind of going around the Northeast and the Midwest. And how to hit LA? Who doesn't hit LA? Who doesn't right? hit LA? Who doesn't hit LA? I might move here at some point. I'm working on it too. Are you? Yeah, of course. From Canada? Yep. Yeah, I do too. Good. Okay. Should like we'll do another show again. Sounds good. I love that. Uh-huh. Um, and so how did you first get into music? How did I first get, like seriously or like as a kid? When you're on that? Okay, what first inspired you? What first inspired me was the pop rock of the 90s. So like, Third Eye Blind and oh, okay. uh, Matchbox 20 and Goo Goo Dolls. Like, it's so, really like melodious, song, song. melodious songs and songwriters. Yeah. And, and, um, I was really inspired by that. I always wanted to like write a hit, hit song, hit catchy song. So many people right. would be like, "Oh, I love this jam." So I kind of a lot of the songs that I remember and uh, relate to were kind of love songs. Actually, yeah. huh? I can tell that because you, you you write a lot of love love music. I, I was I was listening to you. I was up out there. Yeah. I was in the car. I saw you. Yeah. you Standing against the bar. Right? How do you miss me? I got red hair. He does. He does. <laughs> actually, I thought our tones were kind of similar. We both have kind of a. Uh, um, Oh, not a whispery tone, but there's something about our tone. Yeah, breathy. A little breathy. We should do a duet. Okay. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do it. Let's do it. Should we do one of the week? Or do you want to like try and think um, something right now? I don't, I don't know. That would be, that might be atrocious if we try it right now. <laughs> if of all of you viewers. <laughs> However, we should do when I'm back. I'm going back to New York on Thursday morning. But when I go back, we'll do something. Yeah, I go back to Canada on Sunday. Okay. You're here for a little bit. This is going to be like a cross-continental project. <laughs> that's very exciting. Yeah. Actually, I think we sound really beautiful together. I do too. Yeah. I really do. Yeah, that's awesome. So Dan Godlin has a new CD out. Yes. Has... It's called In Between. It was out like end of April. I've been promoting that. And then... Um, and you're single? Summer Rose. Do you have a video for that I can post underneath the video here? Uh, or it's, above. In the wor- it's in the works. I do have it on YouTube. I have the soundtrack. So you can listen to it on YouTube. But the, the video is in the Okay, so when we get that, I'll post it on here above this video or below, depending on where you're watching this. And um, I can't think, I mean, literally, we just met, so I thought it'd be fun to do five minutes with Dan Godwin. Yeah. And we still have a minute and a half, so maybe we can just what look, are we talking about? look at the ceiling for a bit. Nice ceiling. We did a good paint job. Yeah, actually, it's not bad, eh? It's like gold brush. There's the Canadian, eh? <laughs> That's all. If I didn't, right? you didn't tell me that right? you were from Canada, you just said, hey? I'm like, oh, you're Canadian. That's good. When I got here, there were some people dining on the patio window thing. And I said, will you take a picture of me in front of the room five sign? They said, sure. And I said, I'm sorry to interrupt your meal. She said, are you from Canada? <laughs> <laughs> There's also just this, like, very nice. You, you guys all speak with a very nice tone. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it, but I was just in Toronto. I just played with, with Tyler Hilton. In Toronto? Yes. Where did you play? Uh, Hard Luck Bar. Oh, I haven't been there. And everybody in Canada is so nice. Genuinely, like, nice. I'm like, why are you being so nice right now? I'm from New York. I'm from New York City. Right. Where everybody's like, like, get out of my way, you know? <laughs> but Canadians are sort of just... We are. At the core, they're very nice people. I think so. I worked, yeah. at, I worked under the table, waitressing at a bar, a uh, big pizza place in New York. And every time... Like the guy running the food would pass me the food to deliver. I'd say thank you, and he'd say, "What the fuck are you thanking me for? It's my goddamn job." <laughs> and I felt bad about it for a while, even. That's how Canadian I am. And then you know I was what? like, "Whatever." Never stop saying thank you. Yeah. I mean, that's, you, you viewers out there, 
number one thing, I, not number one, but thing number two, number three, that I've learned is always be thankful. Gratitude. Thank, thank you is the best thing you can say. Just say it as much as possible. But you have to mean it. You can't just say it like, oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. You gotta mean it. You know? Yeah, you gotta mean it. Say thank you. Yeah, yeah. And so thank you, Dan Goslin, for spending five minutes with me and my fans. And thank you. And thank you, fans. We'll see you soon. Bye.